his principles and ideologies are morally unjust to the Libyan people. He must be stopped and implement a real constitution with just ideals. Libyan people are living on a socialism de demographic which just focus on person principles and ideologies when a government should be a collective unit focusing as one body and one principle. As the United States, we have a right to speak against the government. So do I feel the Libyan people should have that right as well. We have groups, as I mentioned before, such as the Tea Party, who consistently speaks against the government on the problematic issues. The Libyan people can't even speak against the problematic issues that they're faced with in their world. They're living in a world of uncertainty. Uncertainty. They're not able to pick up the books that they want to read, speak against them. They're living in an unknown world, an unknown sight. Libya is facing turmoil and being forced to believe one man's principles and ideologies. Now, how will we, as Americans, stand up against this man who's treating these people this bad? Who's, who's, who's bluntly beating these people? Who's treating them because he don't even know what he's doing? He's living off his own mind his own values. His one main focus is oil. Thank you for your time. Thank you. Thank you.